Okay, what next? You just finished the six-week challenge. Great job. Congratulations. Um, take the rest of the week and uh, relax a little bit, right? You just worked out really hard for the last six weeks. So maybe you don't come into the gym for the rest of the week. That's okay. Maybe you go up the diet a little bit. That's okay, right? Um, go, you know, on Monday, just go back on the diet, okay? Um, how long do you need to continue to be on the diet for? Well, it just depends on you. Do you want to keep the results that you've gotten? Then you probably should continue to stay on the diet. Do you want to get better results? Then you probably should continue to stay on the diet, okay? Um, we will have a transition talk to go over the transition diet. We generally do those every six weeks, plus or minus two. It just kind of depends on schedule. Basically, if we do them too often, then we only get like one or two people in it. Um, so we like to do it with a group of people just like we do the nutrition orientation. And so during that transition talk, we'll go over the transition diet, right? Um, when, you know, like who should come to the transition talk? Well, basically if you've gotten to the point where you're happy with your results, then that's a good reason to come to the transition talk. Okay. Um, should you continue to follow the six week plan? Yeah, absolutely. If you want to work in some more fat, like if you're on the 1.25 plan, um, then what you can easily do is add about a tablespoon of fat, which is about a thumb. Right there it is. Okay. Um, if you're on like the other plans, 1.75 or the 2.25 or whatever the case may be, um, and you want to eat a little bit more carbohydrates, that's fine. Eat a little more carbohydrates. But listen, at the end of the day, you still have to be mindful of what you're eating. So you can't, if you're on the 1.75 plan and you're supposed to have half a carb at breakfast and half a carb at lunch, and you just indiscriminately decide that you're going to eat um, this much rice, well, you're going to gain weight back. Okay. So you still have to follow some kind of a plan. There's nothing that you can do from a nutritional standpoint that allows you to be able to get results or keep results that does not involve some kind of tracking. There is nothing out there. Okay, You have to track somehow, whether that's tracking serving size, whether that's tracking weight, whether that's tr using your hand, oh, your hand to do it, right, like a cupped hand or whatever. The, you have to track. You can't just indiscriminately eat because indiscriminately eating got you basically to where you are now, right? Where you're you were unhappy with uh, your health and you're unhappy with your appearance. That's why you came to us, right? So you, the best thing is to just continue following the six-week plan. Keep milking those results. Um, keep your eyes peeled for your new message from your new accountability coach, which will be your member accountability coach. Um, they'll send you, they should be sending you a message within the next couple days. Um, and then you just keep that dialogue going that you've had the last six weeks with um, either me or Jenny or Lara, you keep that dialogue going with your new accountability coach, um, and you're gonna get great results, and you're gonna have a fantastic time. You could, and and it's gonna be awesome. All right. If you have any questions, send us a message or shoot us an email.